be making basics. What's going on YouTube? Beat Making Basics back again with another dope video. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe because we're coming back to back with bangers. Today's video, I'm gonna be going over how to download or update to the new and latest version of Logic Pro 10.8, all right? Logic 10.8 is crazy fire, bro. They have so much stuff going on with it and I can't wait to really just unpack it um, over the next couple of days or whatever. First things first though, we do have to get it. And so what I'm gonna do is there's a kind of a roundabout way that we're gonna go to um, get the latest OS. Like sometimes you might have a problem where you're trying to come in here and grab the latest update. So like for instance, I'm looking in my updates, I don't see any of it. Um, and doesn't no matter what I do here. But if I come over here to the, uh, to the Apple at the top, go to system settings and go to general. Then I can come over here to software update here. And now I'll be able to go ahead and update to the latest um, Mac OS. Okay, you have to do that before you can able to, before you can get, um, you know, get anything uh, started here. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video for a second. We're gonna go ahead and upgrade to the latest uh, version of this Mac OS. Then that's gonna allow us to go ahead and update to the latest version of, of, of Logic Pro 10.8. All right, so give me a couple seconds and we're gonna go ahead and do that. This is what's new um, in the update, y'all. This is pretty dope. So a lot of my videos I've used like Ozone 9 or Ozone, you know, another version of Ozone to master beats. Now Logic has a mastering assistant, okay? It's an effect plugin, offers a quick and easy way to add a final professional polish, okay? So that's gonna save a lot of time instead of having to go in and click on um, Ozone 9 or Ozone 11 or whatever. You can master your beats or your songs right in Logic. Um, especially for people who don't have a whole lot of third-party plugins, this is gonna be awesome for you. Sample Alchemy, which is pretty dope. I mean, basically, uh, with Sample Alchemy, the Sample Alchemy instrument plugin, you can transform a single audio sample into a playable instrument. So I can't wait to show y'all this and, and jump into that as well. There's a, like I said, this is a dope update. Then it has this thing called Beat Breaker. It's a multi-effect plugin. You can radically reshape and shuffle audio in real time. So this, they're just really setting it up to where you can now take your sampling game and your sound game to the next level. Slip and rotate tools. The tools menu in the tracks area and the time-based editors are now including um, slip and rotate tools, which can use, which you can use to move content in audio and software instrument regions without moving the region boundaries. Okay, so that's something we're gonna have to actually show you once we get into this update. 32-bit recording, so like a better quality here. New sound packs, you know we love new sounds. And then they got other features here too, okay? So this is a dope, dope, dope update. Again, I can't wait to really like break down the mastering assistant, sound, sample alchemy, beat breaker. And then I'm probably gonna also hit up this new sound pack. So that's like at least four videos that I'm gonna be doing um, on this update. So y'all buckle your seatbelts, man. Like I said, we're gonna wait for this to download this Mac OS new update. I got about 20 minutes left. And once that gets done, we're gonna get into the actual, you know, Logic Pro 10, uh, 0.8 download or update or whatever. But yeah, I'll see y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so we finished downloading this and now I pretty much just have to go ahead and continue here and agree to all this. Put my password in. And then we have yet another hour or whatever we gotta wait. Um, so we just gotta go ahead and wait for this to do that. So I just wanted to kind of show y'all this process um, here. It's not an easy process, but it's easy, you know what I'm saying? It's kinda gotta do some other things while you are doing this. But yeah, anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and show y'all what we got going on here. You might be new 
um, and don't know what we got going on, but we got courses, sound kits, and templates here that you can get from our site, beatmakingbasics.com. Um, let's just check out these courses. Um, first of all, you know, I just, I've been working with, you know, pricing my stuff here. Um, some of the stuff, sometimes I, I raise the price lower or whatever, but I have a lot of different deals here um, to make things affordable for you. First thing I'm gonna talk about is this beat making master bundle. Basically, this comes with all of the uh, products on our whole site here. So it's like everything, all the different courses, all the drum kits, the, you know, the templates, all of that. So you can get that from here. Um, if you want, you can use Shop Pay. Boom, boom, boom. All right. So enough of this commercial break. Let's just go ahead and check on this update. And as you can see here, we have 28 minutes remaining. So. I'm gonna have to go ahead and pause the video again because I don't want y'all to sit here for another 28 minutes and listen to me, um, you know, just talk about whatever. I'll see you in a minute. All right, y'all, so we have everything downloaded and everything. Now the last thing we gotta do is restart the Mac. And, I got, uh, and again, we still haven't, you know, updated to the latest uh, Logic Pro 10 for eight yet. So let me just do that. We will start this and then, yeah, we are, we about it there, man. Now that we got the new latest update um, on the Mac OS, now we can do this one here. Looks like we had to do a little clicking, click all the way through to the actual page here before you get the update, but actually updating pretty quick. The main thing was the uh was that Mac OS, man. That Mac OS had a lot of stuff on there. I don't know if y'all want that type of content, man. Me to kind of bring and break down like Mac OS type stuff as well. Let me know in the comment section, man. I might, you know, bring some videos on, you know, just some general just system stuff. Finally, it's done. Um now we're gonna go ahead and open it up. Version 10.8. Awesome. The first thing I'm noticing is that everything looks kind of new you know what i'm saying like this me thing you can go between these different tracks here that looks new i actually like that and then it looks like you can create a pattern track which is pretty dope as well so that was a good idea for them to break this up because if you remember looking at some of my videos like i might start off with a pattern track and then convert it to a midi instrument track and stuff like that and then we, we haven't really been using the drummer a whole lot in our videos, but we might start bringing this in here because it's definitely a great way to get some drum patterns going. And then obviously we got the audio. So here's Sample Alchemy, you feel me? We'll get into this in a later video. You feel me? So it looks like you could drag your files here. You got different stuff you can do there. Oh yeah, this is gonna be nice. You know what I mean? So we still got the quick sampler. We still got the sample multi sampler. Now we just got this other sampler called Sample Alchemy, which sounds pretty lit. Um, yeah and i'm sure that we can come over here to apple loops and there's some new new sounds and stuff like that in here yeah anyway y'all this is how you download uh logic point i mean logic pro 10.8 all right this was an exhaustive video really broke down everything from the ins and outs of you know getting to the new uh, um, operating system the roundabout way to do that and also you know after everything's said and done going ahead and clicking through and downloading um logic pro 10.8 um i'm going to get into all of the different features and everything in the later videos to come but i just wanted to just do a basic video introductory video to logic pro 10.8 and then also how to download it so make sure you subscribe to the channel make sure that you go ahead and smash the like button make sure you share the video as well Make sure you visit our site, beatmakingbasics.com. Um, in the next videos to come, we're going to be dropping into, you know, some of the other stuff like the beat, uh, you know, some of the new sounds, the uh, sample alchemy and everything else that we got going on here. So appreciate you watching. I'll see you in the next one.